Have you ever noticed how all the Pixar movies seem oddly connected? If you have, you're not alone. From Toy Story all the way to Coco, the Pixar theory is a complex, intricately thought out, and intriguingly pieced together thought process, tying all of Pixar's little Easter eggs together to make a sense of a shared Pixar cinematic universe. I'm Mike with List 25, and here are 25 reasons the Pixar theory might be true. Twenty-five, The Magic in Brave This movie may explain why many of the creatures are able to act like humans, talk, and behave the way they do. Other than The Good Dinosaur, it's the earliest setting in the Pixar timeline, and features Merida learning about the magic that can turn her mother into a bear and move inanimate objects. Twenty-four, Human Energy much later, in the 1960s, the Supers in the Incredibles movie discovered this magic as human energy. However, through Buddy's inventions of both AI bots and zero-point energy, other things in the Pixar universe began to transpire. 23. By and large. Also in The Incredibles, the massive corporation By and Large is introduced. It plays a prominent role in the Pixar movie universe, especially regarding Buddy's AI inventions. But more about that later. 22. The Toys The toys in Toy Story clearly have come alive thanks to the magic in Brave. They develop a code of rules and even find that human love is an energy source. Without it, they will lose their purpose and become inanimate collector toys. Oh, and who makes all these toys? By and large. 21. Emotions as a Source of Energy Along with love being a source of energy, the monsters in Monsters, Inc. create machines that can harness and tap into human emotions for energy. Fear and joy are, of course, two prime sources. This becomes more evident in the movie Inside Out, with Riley's emotions losing their power when she forgets her past. The monsters, of course, become a big part of the universe later down the line. 20. Memories Which leads us to the power of memories. Along with magical energy powering inanimate objects and emotional energy powering machines, we discover that memories play a huge part in keeping certain beings alive. For instance, in Inside Out, Riley's imaginary friend Bing Bong ceased to exist when she forgot about him. The same law of memories having power over existence play a big part in Coco as well. 19. Talking Fish Meanwhile, we discover in Finding Nemo and Finding Dory that fish can also talk and are fairly advanced and can speak many languages. However, humans are keeping them in captivity, and some may be conducting experiments on them, causing a possible rift between humans and animals. 18. Controlling Humans Things become more heated between humans and animals when Remy the Rat controls a human to cook for him. For the first time, talking animals and humans are interacting in the Pixar universe, but it clearly isn't for the better. Eventually, things go awry. 17. The Great Toy Revolt In Toy Story 3, toys have had enough of humans. Lotso the Huggin' Bear leads a wide-scale revolt against them, hating that they discard toys like they're worthless. But more intriguingly, by and large appears in this movie, not to mention a letter from Carl and Ellie Fredrickson that appears to be written to Andy. 16. Corporate Takeover Years later, after Carl and Ellie wrote a letter to Andy, by and large expanded rapidly and tried to swallow up every last bit of real estate in their path in the movie Up. Eventually, that meant trying to kick out Carl from his house. When he took his house into the skies, he discovered animals can talk when he met Doug. 15. The Animal and Human War with the expansion of By and Large, pollution became the last straw for the animals and toys, leading to an animal and human war. Inevitably, By and Large and its autonomous machines, as seen in cars, won out, leading to a mostly uninhabited, polluted landscape. This pollution forced humanity off Earth. That's why we don't see any humans in the Cars movies. 14. The Cars Era Humanity's absence opened the door for magically talking machines to thrive on Earth. From Italy to Japan, they populated and rebuilt every corner of the globe, increasing their technology and becoming faster than ever. However, eventually, all things must end, and the cars died out. 13. Wally. -E. With the cars gone, nothing on Earth truly existed. 
The Earth's global collapse as seen in WALL-E is the inevitable and pivotal moment in the Pixar Universe timeline. With war and pollution caused by by and large, the Earth becomes a wasteland with few inhabiting it, like WALL-E and a cockroach. But eventually, WALL-E finds life growing again as a tiny green plant and tries to save it in a boot, a detail that becomes important later. 12. Autonomous Takeover We also learn in WALL-E that by and large eventually came under the control of the machines, also known as Auto. Eve needed to take the plant to the Axiom to show that Earth was habitable again, but the ship wanted to keep that from happening. Meanwhile, humans were lazy and fat, relaxing on their giant crew spaceship because the machines made them docile and comfortable. 11. The Boot At the end of Wally, the plant he and Eve saved eventually grows into a tree out of the boot. That mighty tree eventually repopulates the Earth and becomes the tree from a bug's life. 10. Superbugs In a bug's life, these creatures are clearly superbugs because they can live a much longer amount of time, with one ant declaring he feels 90 again. Also, humans have either not repopulated the Earth or are sparsely around, because the bugs in the movie make no mention of them being a threat. 9. Radiation At some point, humans do return to Earth. Hundreds of years later, the radiation left behind by, by and large, ended up modifying the animals and humans' DNA, making them monsters. This last piece of information comes directly from the DVD extras. Of course, monsters are taught that humans are toxic, and from another dimension, which leads us back to the idea that they use machines to convert human emotion into energy. 8. Boo Boo, the little girl in Monsters, Inc., is much more than meets the eye. As the theory goes, she ends up going through one of the many doors to travel between dimensions, but this time goes back in time to the period when Brave is set. Boo is the old witch that starts the magic in the first place. It's not as far-fetched as you might think. In Brave, in the old woman's house, there's a carving of Sully on a wooden pillar. 7. Gastos so, I've given you the rundown of the Pixar theory, but you're still not convinced. Here's some more. The restaurant Gusto's from Ratatouille appears in the movie Cars 2, but the machines change the name to Gasto's. 6. Lotso's New Home Remember how I said Carl Fredrickson wrote a letter to Andy? Well, there are even more connections between the two. When Carl's house flies past a little girl's house, we see her playing with a Buzz Lightyear action figure and off in the corner by her bed is Lotso the Huggin' Bear. 5. Riley Riley from Inside Out eventually appears briefly in Finding Dory at the Aquarium, proving she's just one of the many humans among talking animals. 4. Hostile Takeover On the By and Large website news section in the Sound and Fury of Corp Punk article, Refi's next tour is called the Hostile Takeover Tour, likely a reference to the coming war between humans, animals, and machines. 3. Pizza Planet Truck The Pizza Planet Truck makes several appearances throughout the Pixar universe. In most movies, the truck is controlled by humans, but in the Cars era, you'll see he makes an appearance as a magical and totally autonomous machine. 2. Comics Clearly, the adventures of The Incredibles would want to be passed down from generation to generation. In Finding Nemo, there's a brief scene of a boy waiting at the dentist reading a comic book about Mr. Incredible. 1. Disney admitted it. If you're still not convinced, you should maybe sit down for this one. Disney themselves admitted in 2017 that the Pixar films are all part of the same cinematic universe. Of course, they didn't admit that this theory was correct, but if they're all part of the same universe, this theory seems pretty likely. So, what do you think about the Pixar theory? Let us know in the comments below, or tweet your answer to us at List25. Enjoying our lists? Be sure to click that subscribe button on the bottom right and the notification bell so you don't miss out on new ones every Monday through Friday. Share them with friends and help us consistently conciliate curiosity. And if you want even more lists, check out these videos here or just head to our website at list25.com.